Hi, my name is Zahin, I'm in year two and I'm currently studying English language and literature and health and social care. Definitely one of my favourite things about English especially because it's such a creative subject is the support that you're getting from other people is crazy. You've got your teachers who are just giving you lots of stuff if you need help. Even if you don't need help, they are just constantly giving you everything you could ever need. And then you've also got the friends that you make in your class. When I was going into Long Road, it was scary. I had my friends, but they were all, you know, we we're all doing different subjects. And English was just so many people who were just so kind. And we all just worked together because in a way we were learning all together. We were learning this new course and you just bounce off other people so easily. You know the people on my table they were amazing and we were just constantly just you know going back and forth and just giving each other our ideas and sharing our ideas with the class so that support was crazy and that definitely 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 is one of my favorite things about this course is the support is crazy <laughs> when i was picking my a levels i definitely knew i wanted to do something english related because i loved it from primary i loved it through gcse and i knew that i wanted to carry on doing english even before I knew what college I was going to go to, I was just set on doing English. So I was looking at all the different college websites and through UCAS and Long Road definitely stood out to me just because of the detail they were talking about going into, you know, dissecting poems line by line, word by word, just going through this crazy amount of detail that I didn't even think was possible. But it definitely did and when I went to the open days and the open evenings and spoke to the teachers, they were just so kind and they were so passionate about English, which was definitely what made me excited because I didn't think anyone, you know, loved English as much as I did. I thought I was weird, I'm not going to lie, but it's just crazy how much I learned through that course and how much I didn't think I would be able to learn. So this year I'm going to Anglia Ruskin to study English literature and my teachers and this course was definitely, definitely a big part of that because there are so many different things inside English at a degree level. You've got creative writing, language, literature, things like that. My teachers, I spoke to them and they definitely helped me decide where my strengths were and where I would want to put those strengths in a sense. So I chose literature because this course made me realise how much I love the literature side of English and just reading the books and going in and dissecting it and just figuring out the meanings behind it. So that's what I'm going to go do. And then I hope to become a primary school teacher one day and then hopefully move into a secondary teacher um, teaching English. And then who knows where I can go from there. I could become a sixth form English teacher because they are all amazing. But um, yeah, that's my plan. There are so many other things that I wish I could tell you about this course and this college, but we would be here for a very long time if I did. I just wanted to say good luck in finding the course that you want to do and I hope you carry on doing the things that you love because this college will definitely, definitely encourage you to do that. Good luck and thank you. My name's Bethan and I take history, politics and English literature and language at Long Road. I've been asked by the English department to speak on why I think you should take English literature and language. Firstly, if you like English GCSE but not the most active reader like me, then this course is perfect for you because it has a really nice balance of writing, reading, analysing and topics like novels, poetry, spoken language and creative writing. So if you're daunted by the idea of just language or just literature, then I would recommend this course for you. Also, I love this course because it's such a broad course. Whether you want to go to uni or get an apprenticeship or a job, English literature and language as a combined course will give you the upper hand. I would like to go on to study journalism at uni and English being a very respected core subject will help me get there. As this is a two year course, as many like many others at Long Road, you get to know your teacher so well. Um, so they're really able to give you the support that you need to do well in this course. Um, so thanks Emma for the support and take English Literature and Language. Hi, I'm Luca and I'm a Year 1 student studying English Literature and Language as well as Film Studies and History. I decided to take English Literature and Language as I found it really interesting at GCSE and I didn't want to particularly just choose one so I decided to do both. Um, I've really enjoyed English Literature and Language at A-Levels so far um, as it's a really interesting subject and the texts that we study are really interesting and some of them are still relevant to today such as The Colour Purple where, um, where it focuses on white privilege and racism in America and that's still really relevant today as we see with everything that's been happening with George Floyd and the Black Lives Matter movement, um, it's all still really relevant. And the texts are all equally as interesting and 
in English, they've made it quite enjoyable as we get to watch the films such as In Cold Blood and Othello. We watch the play and the film, which help us um, understand the text a little bit more better and we get a visual representation of what's happening. And sometimes um, you remember something from a film that you wouldn't really remember from a book, which also helps you remember things, which is really not which is a really nice aspect. But um, the group discussions as well as the class discussions also really help in expanding your knowledge and your points of view as um, listening to the different different points that are made in the class discussions and group discussions really help expand your ideas and your points, which is really helpful when you're trying to form the arguments for an essay. Another great thing is that the teachers are there to support you and help you and they really they really do care for you and about you and um, they want to see you do well, which is really great. And they they make English and studying English a lot better and make it really enjoyable for you, which is great because you don't want to end up in a subject where you're not enjoying it or you don't like the teachers. I think you should study English literature and language if you've enjoyed it at GCSE and you enjoy writing and reading. I think if you really enjoy those subjects, then you'll really enjoy English literature and language and you should definitely go for it. I'm currently planning on studying law at university and English literature and language really helps um, with law as you learn analytical skills, essay writing skills and descriptive skills from English literature and language and that really links into law as law is a, re is a very, es very essay based subject and it's very wordy so English literature and language um, links in really well to law. So if you really enjoy reading, writing, then you should definitely go for English literature and language and yeah, you'll really enjoy it. I definitely have. Hi, I'm Saffron. I'm year 12 at Long Ride and I'm studying A-level English language and literature, A-level photography and graphic design, which is a level three applied diploma. So I don't know if you'll be watching this because you just want to hear from a current student in general or because you want to hear specifically about English, but either way, I'm going to be giving a quick little review, I suppose, of what it's like to study A-level English language and literature at Long Road. So, I personally love the course, and I just want to start this by saying that actually I was really, really nervous to start the course at the beginning of Long Road because I felt that English took a very specific skill set and I wasn't sure that I had that. But I really, really love the course now because I've learnt that there's so much more to English than just reading. There's also a lot about history and politics and society and you really get to engage with that in the course at Long Road. I think if I had to pick my favourite thing about studying English at Long Road it would be that because the broadness of the subject means that you're really not limited at all to fictional texts and especially because it's a language and literature course it means that you're also exploring real examples of spoken language. For example not long ago we did an analysis of the speech that Boris Johnson gave to the country when he was announcing the lockdown and it meant that um, there was a lot of context we could put with the terminology and the words that we'd been learning in lessons and put them into real life scenarios. I was actually chatting to my English teacher Emma not long ago about how there's so much packed into this course and there's so much context that really comes from all directions. For example, two of the books that we've studied so far are The Colour Purple by Alice Walker and In Cold Blood by Truman Capote. And both books have so much historical context behind them, things about race and poverty and feminism and all of these rich themes that have so much context behind them there's so much to write about you're really not limited and it's really not difficult to find something to write about when you've got books with so much depth to them so i would definitely say that you should really consider english not only if you're interested in reading and exploring texts but also if you're interested in current affairs and history and politics and society and all of these themes that are actually really key parts of english that maybe weren't so key in gcse english but definitely are in a level so overall, I, I really think that it's a great subject, even if it's not something that you want to focus on in your career in the future. I think that it's a really great subject for improving life skills and helping out your other subjects as well. So I really don't think there's a bad reason for choosing it. Other than that, all I can really say is that I've loved the course so far and I'm really excited to move on to what we're doing next as well, which will be our coursework. So um, all I can say is I hope this helped and good luck with your application. Hi, I'm Lucy. I'm a second year A-level student at Long Road Sixth Form College and I studied A-level graphic design, English literature and language and photography and I also did EPQ in animation which I really enjoyed. I chose to study at Long Road 
because it had the courses that I was interested in with the higher success rates in the subjects that I wanted to do. And I'm really happy that I did choose Song Road because I had a great time and a great experience. I think my favourite thing about coming to Long Road was meeting new people and making new friends from different secondary schools um, and different colleges. Also the teachers were really supportive and anything that needed help with in class or if it was coursework related the teacher would always point you in the right direction and do the best they could to help you improve and um, get the grade that you wanted. I also really enjoyed the subjects that I did. Uh, I really liked graphic design, it's very creative, so it was photography and there were loads of new skills to learn which I hadn't learnt before. I also really liked studying English at A Level 2 because it was challenging at times but it's quite an enjoyable subject. You get to learn a range of different um, literature and language techniques and skills which can be easily applied to your other courses and can also be really good for further education and I just think it's a very useful subject to have and I really liked it. In September I'm going to do an art foundation course and then I plan to do a BA in graphic design at university. I'm very pleased with all the A-levels that I've done at Long Road. I think especially with graphic design and photography they've helped build my art portfolio but I also did an EPQ which is an extended project qualification and it's where you get to choose any subject that you want to do. It's equivalent to half an A-level and you can choose if you want to do it or not. I think it's really good because it lets you explore a subject or a theme that you may have not have come across in your A-level courses that you've chosen. So I chose to learn how to make an animation which was really good because I learned loads of new skills and it was all self-taught so it was quite challenging, it was quite hard but I thought it was a great extra subject to do and I'm very happy that I did it. Overall I think Long Road is a great sixth form and I would highly recommend coming here. Hi I'm Eden, I'm a current year 12 student and I study psychology, criminology and English Lit and Lang. The English course, to put it simply, is incredible. It really is incredible. We study such a lovely variety of texts uh, like Alice Walker's The Colour Purple in Cold Blood and Othello. They are just such wonderful pieces to read and I would highly recommend reading them even if you don't take this course. But um, we also study poetry which is always a lot of fun and spoken language which I had never done previously and I really find it fascinating. It's really interesting analysing that. There is also a creative aspect to this course which is from the coursework where you will write a fiction and a non-fiction piece based on one genre so i've decided to go completely out of my comfort zone and have picked the genre of romance and i just really hope it goes well because at this moment in time i'm not sure <laughs> um yeah my teacher had uh, me hounding her quite a lot about that because it is really interesting and if you like creative writing it's it is amazing it's one of the main reasons why i actually chose this course so look into it, I would. Uh, another thing with this course is that the teachers are so, so supportive. They are really there to offer their help and guidance and to make you feel so confident in your writing. They have helped me a lot and I'm sure they can help you. And they don't rush things. They take their time to make sure you really do understand all the text and everything. They are just so amazing at their jobs and I'm so thankful for them. After Long Road, I plan on going to university to study either psychology or English. Bit of a different choices, but either way, this course will help me because of the skills you pick up, like analytical thinking and the ability to write essays, which in university is a really valuable skill, so it's very important. And this course is just, it's so much fun, it really is. You have lots of debates in classes about meanings you get to know your whole class and you do engage a lot and it is really good for your confidence I'd say I mean I I find it's definitely helped me so I do not regret taking the subject at all it is my favorite course and I would 
highly recommend you look into really seriously thinking about applying to this course because I don't think you'd regret taking it. It is incredible. Thank you. Hello, I'm Ben Rogers. I'm a year two student at Long Road Sixth Form College and I study A-level English, A-level PE and A-level Media. My favourite thing about the English Literature Language combined course is, you know, the support that the teachers bring to you alongside the course. You never feel like you're alone. You never feel like everything's getting too much because they're always there just to support you every step of the way. College can be really daunting for 16, 15, 16, 17 years old. As you know, it's a whole new different ball game from secondary school. But I think the support that the teachers bring on all the courses, but particularly in the English courses, you know, they really, really are there just for you. And they want you to do the best, want you to succeed and reach your full potential. I think, you know, if you're keen for English, you like reading, you like writing, then, you know, it'd be a great course for you to study. You study a whole wide range of courses, of course, of books, poems, plays, you know, a few of the plays we do, History Boys, which is James Corden, really funny, really entertaining, you know, you can really get into read out as a class if you like doing that, you know, play a part each and that can get really like, just bonding as well, you can meet new people in the class, have a laugh, it's, it's, yeah, it's really fun actually. As well as this, get a fellow, which is a Shakespeare novel, which I'm sure the majority of you would have done at secondary school. Again, really entertaining, really good. Alongside this, you do book a crime novel called In Cold Blood by Truman Compote, based on a true story. If that's your street, like crime and mysteries, then that's, again, another really good read, another really entertaining. It's dark, but it's really good. Got the colour purple, which is really prominent, especially now. It's really can really touch on you know some of today's problems. Obviously, with everything that's going on with you know the Black Lives Matter movement, it's really fo focuses on, on racism and how you know mistreated black people were back in back in the days, and obviously to some extent they still are now. I think new students would love to study on this course if they were you know keen readers, keen English students, if you enjoyed it at secondary school, you know, definitely hop on board. If you like the creative writing, then again, it's another real chance for you to get creative in this course with the coursework. It's most of it, you know, you pick the books you want to study for the comparative essay. You get a choice, you pick two, you pick, you know, your forefront novel, which is the majority of your essay is going to be about. And then a side essay, which you compare it to. And then you get to write a book review or a film review or a review just on, you know, anything of your choice, really, that links to your chosen genre. And then you have to write, you know, a, a short story from your chosen genre as well. So it's, that's a really creative side of, of the subject there. Uh, a bit about me. You know, as I've said, I've studied A-level PE, A-level media and A-level English combined course for two years now. My plans, obviously, all going to plan and hopefully all of this can blow over soon enough. Is so that I will go on to university, looking like it's, well, it's going to be Leeds University to study sports journalism. Obviously, English has helped a great deal with the way I write and obviously to be a sports journalist you have to write at a high level and English is no doubt helped me just with punctuation, grammar and just ha everything has to be spot on of course. My dream career would be working at you know a mainstream multimedia broadcaster or if on radio with Talk Sport, BBC Radio 5 Live, on the TV with Sky Sports, BBC, you know that is my goal is to go to the top. And I, I, Long Road is going to play a big part in that, hopefully. Um, I think that's everything from me. Hopefully I've sold the course here. And we look forward to seeing you, hopefully in September, I think, if everything goes well, for a, uh, your start to Long Road life. Thank you very much.